Hey guys! Hey guys! Tons of you have been asking us to make keto meal prep. That's right. So today we're going to turn our most popular recipe into a keto recipe. So let's get started. Oh, you should do it like the original. Do it like the original. Ready? Go. Hey guys, AD with you here, and today we're making meal prep. Meal prep will help you save time, money, and keep track of your fitness goal. So let's get started. <laughs> anyway, to get started, we're gonna get started on the um, garlic. So keto, you don't get a lot of garlic, but we're gonna allow you to have one little clove. Let's go. Boom. In there with the garlic. There we go. Now we have a chicken breast. We have 300 grams. We're gonna cut it, or butterfly in half. All the way through, boom, into the bowl. Perfect. Easy as that, guys. Here we go. To that, we're gonna add half a lemon. Again, on keto, you gotta be careful with all the carbs. And surprisingly, lemon has carbs. And then, I'm gonna add Himalayan sea salt. <laughs> Say one thing and you get labeled for life, man. Pepper. Himalayan sea salt. So that was on YouTube. YouTube getcha. <laughs> yep. Here I have some Himalayan pink salt or Himalayan rock salt. So Himalayan sea salt. Then we go with pepper. Mix it all together. Mmm. So fresh. Okay. There we go. Set the chicken aside. When it comes to wasn't my phone. Whose phone was that? Yours. Turn it off, bro. It's right there. When it comes to keto, you can only. Eat what are you looking at, a ghost? <laughs> when it comes to keto, your daily carb intake should be about five to 10%. So it's very important to weigh up everything that you eat because- There's a lot of carbs and stuff. A lot of carbs and stuff. So here we have cauliflower. I'm gonna weigh it up and we're gonna go for 400 grams total for the whole recipe. So let's go. So we're gonna hack into our cauliflower and we're gonna get rid of the stalk and we're just gonna start weighing it up and we want 400 grams. Perfect. You guys, of course, can put in a blender, use a grater. I don't think you need to do that. Just all you need is a trusty knife. This is how we do it. Okay, so because this is a keto recipe, we're gonna add in a ton of coconut oil. So to start, we're gonna do a quarter cup into our cauliflower rice. Oh, the coconut oil. When you're on keto, you wanna leave 70% of your calories to come from fat. So, turn your heat on high. Once the coconut oil is melted, we're gonna add in the cauliflower. <laughs> and we're gonna give it a stir. Then we're gonna add in a quarter cup of flax seeds. I love flax seeds. Beautiful. Stir them in as well. Mm. Add in some salt. That Himalayan sea salt. <laughs> you need a good amount of salt on a keto diet, so don't hold back. Get it in there. Get those electrolytes. That's it. Pepper, cracked black pepper, straight from the Himalayan mountains. <laughs> Stir it in. So turn it to a medium flame. Pop on the lid. We're gonna make a chicken. Woo. In a grill pan, we're gonna add two tablespoons of coconut oil. Gotta get that coconut oil in, man. Whose phone is on? It's still yours. It's not mine. It is, because mine's off. Why wait for the grill pan to get hot? You can come and stir the cauliflower. Mm. Oh, yeah. Come back on. You actually just leave it a jar. Leave it a jar, you can put a oil on, and some of the steam out. Beautiful. If you don't have a grill pan, that's okay. You can use whatever pan you have. All lemon pan you like. You good, bro? Look at the eyelashes. Bam. Now chicken's in marinating. The oil is hot. We're gonna go in with the chicken. Now, yeah, your splatter screen. Pop it on top. Cook for three minutes on high. give a huge shout out to all of the new people who have been joining our Fit Couple Cooks family since January 1st. Good on you for making New Year's resolutions and welcome to our channel. And if you haven't heard yet, we have released our very first meal prep cookbook. It features 12 weeks 
of meal plans where we give you a step-by-step -step meal prep day action plan which teaches you how to make four recipes at once. We even give you all of the macros and shopping lists. So make sure to click the link in the description box below and go grab your copy. Now it's been three minutes. Take off the spot of God and give him a flip. Cook for another three minutes. Now we're gonna turn off the heat. Take off the spot of God. Beautiful. And let the chicken rest on a pan to the side. On a plate to the side. Plate to the side. Easy as that guys. Chuck it all, you just pour over the top. Now we're gonna turn off the cauliflower rice. Give it a toss. Hey. Phil. Oh fancy. Now let us sit here, we're gonna make the vinaigrette. Because we need to add the now because we have to add tons of fat into this recipe, we're gonna make a tangy, delicious vinaigrette. To a mixing bowl, add half of a cup of olive oil, one tablespoon of Dijon mustard. Get in there, bro. Yeah. And the juice of half of a lemon. Now we all know I hate whisks, but whisk together. And just like that, you have a super quick, yummy vinaigrette. To store this vinaigrette, you have two options. One, you can either divide it up evenly right now and put it on top of the cauliflower rice, the chicken, and the arugula. Or, instead, if you're gonna freeze this meal, you can set it aside, and after you've reheated your meal and you're ready to eat it, you can put it on top and shake it up and turn it into a little salad. Now to the new prep containers, we're gonna add one cup of arugula. Now add one piece of chicken to each container. Divide the cauliflower evenly among the containers. Mm -hmm. Now the chicken was resting, it released a little of the pan juices. So I'm gonna swirl that around with the coconut oil. And I'm gonna add the pan juices onto the chicken. Get over there. Get over there. This meal prep is gonna be great to eat cold. So if you do want to reheat it, I'd probably recommend taking the arugula out, setting it aside, and the sauce aside, and then reheating just the chicken and the cauliflower and then mix it all back together with the arugula and the dressing after. Oh, you know what everyone's gonna tease you about now? What? Cauliflower. Cauliflower? <laughs> What's wrong with cauliflower? Nothing, but everyone always makes fun of the way you say cauliflower. It's cauliflower. Cauliflower. It's cauliflower. It's cauliflower. <laughs> There's an I in there, cauliflower. <laughs> cauliflower. 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 Say it like I'm saying it, cauliflower. Cauliflower. <laughs> Easy as that, guys. Whenever you make one of our meal preps, don't forget to post it on Instagram, hashtag FitCoupleCooks, and tag us at FitCoupleCooks because we love seeing them. And we always respond to you guys. That's right. Have, Have a great... Go. You go. You go. Have a great week. Bye, Bye guys. Namaste.